Hey, man. Yo, yo, I need that bag. Wait, wait. What do you want, man? I'm out of time. Give me that bag. What? Give me the codes. Here. What codes? Give me that bag, man. Where are you going? I just need it for five minutes. Wait, what? What are you talking about, man? I accidentally liked my excess post on Instagram. My battery died. I just need to undo it. Really? I hate you when that happens. What's up guys, my name is Sean, welcome to my tech channel. Hopefully you enjoyed that absolutely unnecessary and random intro I made to review this backpack. I just wanted to have some fun with it. If you guys enjoyed that video and you may be interested in me doing a behind the scene and kind of like walk you guys through how I made that video, as well as a ton of bloopers and a couple of injuries, just remember to give this video a like and I know you guys will be interested in that. And by the way, if this is the first time you're stopping by, in this channel, I review text gadgets, do unboxing reviews and tutorials. So if you like content like this, you may wanna hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification, and don't forget to change the bell notification to all, otherwise you will not be notified every time I drop a video. So let's get to this. This backpack is very unique and that's why I was excited and accepted to review this backpack. This company is not paying me to review this backpack. They did provide the unit for me for free and I get to keep it. But besides that, I'm free to share all my opinions. So I'm gonna be very clear about the pros and cons of you getting this backpack. This is Boost Pack, a battery powered backpack that will give you a ton of juice for a lot of different needs. So uh, we're gonna talk about some specs about this backpack and then I'm gonna bring the camera up so you guys can take a look around. You see exactly how many storage you get, how does the battery work, and things like that. The base price of this backpack is $250. You will get the backpack, you will get a charger, and you will get one 140 watt hour battery, which is equivalent to about 40,000 milliamp battery. Based on FAA regulations, you can actually take uh, two of these batteries on the airplane and you're not gonna have any problems. The second tier, which costs $350, you get a second battery and you get a docking charging station so I can charge two batteries at once and that was 350 each battery if you want to buy it separate is a hundred bucks and the charger the docking charger is 50 bucks so technically you get uh, you pay a hundred dollars more for a second battery and you get the docking charger for free and the third tier which is 399 you get three batteries and uh, the docking charger by the way stay tuned at the end I will reveal uh, some information about a giveaway and some exciting coupons for you guys. You don't want to miss that, uh, but also I will make sure I'll put it down in the description below so you guys can follow along, know exactly what you need to do. In this uh, model uh, that I received, this is the middle tier that is $350. Like I said, you get the backpack itself. You get uh, two of these batteries. Each is forty, about 40,000 uh, milliamp or 140 watt hour battery. Uh, and you get a docking charger to be able to charge two of these batteries at once. Now, there may be some similar products on the market, but what makes this one unique, you actually have an AC port, uh, two AC ports inside this thing. So you can literally plug anything to this. You can plug in a curling iron and with the juice you get from one of these batteries, you can run a curling iron for about one hour, a projector about three or four hours and obviously charging laptops, batteries, things like that is gonna be a piece of cake. Uh, you do get uh, four USB ports and you have two international AC plugs right here. If you don't get the packet that comes with this uh, docking charging station, or if you don't wanna buy that separate, you can simply plug in the power adapter right into this unit right here, and this is how you will charge it. Uh, you can charge the battery. But other than that, uh, it is pretty straightforward. You have these accessible at the top and the battery is plugged in inside at the bottom. I'm gonna pull the camera up, I'll show that to you. The usage for this thing is honestly endless. Think about when uh, you may wanna go hiking. Think about when uh, you work on the go, you travel a lot or um, you go to school and you wanna study outside in the library. You don't have to worry about your phone dying, your 
uh, your laptop's dying and you're gonna have those charges constantly available to you. It takes about, I believe, three and a half hours to charge one of these batteries. So looking at this first glance, I like the fact that it has a very subtle and chic design. The logo uh, is very small, printed um, in white, and the material, this uh, kind of like uh, gray mesh pattern that they have, I love it. I think it hides dirt really well, and it is very, very simple. So I think it's time to pull up the camera so you guys can take a look inside. All right, so here's the back. Let's take a look at it in the front. You have this one zipper up front that goes all the way down to this area. So this is a kind of like a quick access outside. Let's see, on this one side, you have a place to put your bottle. But what's nice is depending on the size of the bottle you have, you have this zipper outside with this little mesh right here. And this way you can put a bigger bottle down here. So there is no pockets on this side, only on one side. There are two main storage areas that you can open up the top layer and the bottom layer. The bottom layer is this right here, which is essentially, there we go, which is essentially where you can also put your laptop. This is a 16 inch MacBook Pro. Let's see how it fits. Very nice. I like that they have this strap right here, just a little extra protection so this won't accidentally slide out. The second pocket right here, it's a short pocket. It comes only down to this area right here. Let's try to take a look what else we have on this side. This is where the battery goes. So, so you can simply slide it in this pocket mesh right here. And you have this cable you would just go ahead, plug it right in, that's it. And this kind of concludes this uh, this back area right here. So the bottom area, the zipper opens all the way down. The top area, it opens all the way down to uh, the middle of the back right here. So this is how you would open it. Now, this is the exciting part about this backpack. So you open up the top layer, you have access to four USB A ports right here and two uh, international universal AC adapter. You would just hit the button at the top and it's on, you're ready to go. You have this mesh area, just a small pocket. You have this one zipper area down here that goes all the way down. And then you have this opening itself. This is basically your main storage area. So right here on your shoulders, you have these two padded areas. So you have this extra because most of the weight is gonna be on these two uh, um, back pieces right here. Also the same or similar type foam, just kind of like extends in to your straps as well. But uh, this is not as thick as this uh, foam right down here. Also a similar foam, just like this one, you find it down here and another secret storage back here. So if you want to hide your wallet, credit cards, things like that, passport, you can put this back here, zip it. And when you put it on your back, no one has direct access to this. So this is where you can have the most secure items in the back side. Oh, the weight of the components, uh, each battery weighs about one and a half pounds and the bag itself without a battery weighs, uh, uh, I think a um, little bit over uh, two and a half pounds. So total about four pounds with one battery, which is actually very similar to most of the other backpacks available in this area. I just found another secret storage. This is cool. <laughs> so there is another small storage right in the strap itself. I don't know, I guess you can put your car keys in here, but you have this small storage back here. So two hidden storage of some sort <laughs> in the back side. Hey, sorry to interrupt the video. I was editing uh, what I shot last night and I realized there are two more things I need to tell you. Number one, I found a third hidden pocket in this bag. So we said we have this pocket back here. We have this pocket in the shoulder strap and the third pocket, I have to look for it, is on this side of the back. So 
because we have this zipper up here, most people would not anticipate to have any additional pocket up front. But if you lift up this flap right here, you have another zipper, you open it up, and the space down here is pretty much the same size as the bag right here. The second thing I wanted to share with you is uh, when you want to use um, this uh, uh, the power pack, you need to go ahead, turn this on. You will see the battery indicator, but it's important for you to remember to turn this off when you're not using this. As far as I understand, it does not have an auto shut off button. Uh, looks like there are some built-in fans to try to keep this cool, but when you're not using this, uh, do remember to go ahead, shut this off so the unit is not working. Back to the video. All right, so let's talk about the giveaway instruction and the coupon code. So first of all, the coupon code is for 15% and is only available to the first 25 uh, customers that use that code. I will be giving away one 50% off uh, coupon code for one of the lucky viewers. And if you want to enter, it's super simple. First of all, you need to subscribe and comment down below. Let me know that you're entering the drawing. You also need to follow me on Instagram as well as uh, the company. I'll put a link down in the description below so you know exactly which accounts you need to go ahead like. And the final action you need to take is to drop a comment in one of the company's uh, posts under Instagram accounts. At the time I'm recording this video, we haven't figured out to which post it's gonna be, but like I said, follow the instruction down in the description below. At the end of the day, is this worth $250 to try to get a bag like this? The answer is maybe, maybe not. If you're someone who don't often go out or you don't work on the go, you don't study on the go, you never have um, any long period of time, you're gonna be away from a plug, maybe this is not the product for you. But if you're someone that you constantly have the need for your electronics to be charged, if you're someone that uh, maybe you are often on call and sometimes you feel like you're tethered down in your house or in your office and you cannot move because your laptop loses battery so fast and so often or your phone and things like that so this is going to make it very easy for you so at the end of the day this is only worth it to the people that will have the need for it and if you're one of those viewers you know who you are and there's a good chance you're right now watching this video. In conclusion, be honest with you, there's a lot I like about this bag from the design to numerous number of pockets and storages that you have inside this bag and most importantly how comfortable it is with those um, uh, thicker uh, padded areas around the back and on the shoulders which is going to be very important if you're going to be hiking or you're going to be carrying this with you uh, when you're walking around. There's really only one thing uh, I wish this bag had, and that was an uh, accessible USB-C port. But the reason that may not be that big of a deal because you actually have a C adapter so you can plug in a charger brick if you want to use your USB type C. This was it guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Drop a comment down below, let me know if you want to uh, win the 50% coupon code and let me know if you have followed all the uh, giveaway instruction but also most importantly if you want to see the behind the scene video of that intro as always thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one <laughs>